Time to play with some clay. Hello, I'm David Lemon, and I've put together a group of instructional DVDs to help those interested in sculpting in clay. This video you're about to watch is a review of one of those DVDs, Creating a Bust of a Viking. At the end of the video, I show you purchasing options for this DVD as well as others on my list. Now, let's take a brief look at what's on this DVD, Creating a Bust of a Viking. One for the uh, base to sit on the sculpting stand, one uh, to attach um, the poles that are made of aluminum wire. I want to get it started. All right, I guess I'll have to get started. I'll be back after I get the uh, armature. It's going to be below this. This is a male skull and this is a female skull, and you can see there's a size difference as well as a definite profile. Uh, now I soften my clay up and this is good for any clay that's a plastiline based clay. Wrap around the bottom part of the armature. Let's see if I'm within my four inches and I am. Now the center of the head. Now I'm going to put the skull right here and work from it. And you got you can sort of feel in your fingers, between your fingers, when the, there's a lump or a little thicker area than. We've gone through the technical on this guy. And now I'm going to take it away from the technical and get into more of the feeling. Just evening out the head, the, yeah, the steel. You got to be helmet. careful how much you have hanging out there and how many undercuts you're going to have because all that adds up cost-wise when you're casting. Key is to work the uh, design of the fur into the uh, design of the piece. I'm just going to put the finishing touches on this guy and uh, well I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, I'm really pleased with how this turned out it was kind of fun doing something completely different uh, from what I normally do let's go to the computer now and I'll show you first you go to my website uh, where I have all my nine instructional DVDs offered to you for sale and uh, are listed and uh, a short review of each uh, DVD. It opens up onto this page, Clay to Bronze, and, uh, and you'll see a review of all my uh, current nine uh, instructional DVDs uh, listed here. Uh, and each one is uh, linked to a YouTube review video of uh, the items or the uh, subject on each one of the uh, DVDs. 
and uh, you pick out the one you want or the ones you want uh, you can pick uh, more than one or all of them but anyway then you go over to the upper part of the uh, right column and there you'll find this drop down menu where you purchase my instructional DVDs and you just uh, click on the little arrow right here and that drops down a menu and it shows you the listing of all available uh, DVDs I currently have available for you to purchase. Purchase uh, more than one um, that's fine if you want to purchase this one uh, uh, DVD or a set of DVDs uh, that's fine too. Uh, there's a there's also available the ability to purchase all of uh, the selected nine uh, DVDs and uh, in one package and you can save uh, over a hundred dollars in that purchase. So using the drop down menu you go down until you find one that you want for instance for instance creating a horse's head in clay you click on it and then you click on add to cart when you click on the uh, add to cart a page will come up uh, linked to PayPal your PayPal account you just uh, make your purchase if you want to add another one to your cart you just uh, go down and uh, for instance uh, a full figure of a mountain man uh, click on that add that to your cart then it comes up uh, on your PayPal page again and so now you got two DVDs and uh, with the total and everything that you pay to uh, PayPal of course all right I hope that's helpful I hope uh, you got something from this and uh, I hope I've uh, perked up your interest in sculpting it's a wonderful uh, career it's a wonderful hobby uh, you can make into a career and uh, it, it, the, the world opens up to you when you when you can sculpt and you, eventually at, you'll figure out ways of sculpting better every day every time you sculpt something you'll learn something from the last one you did and that's I still learn I'm doing this for geez over 50 years and I'm still learning I'm still doing things for the first time so you, you just have to have patience and uh, know that uh, eventually all this is going to work out fine all right um, I'm going to let you go now and uh, see you next time happy sculpting